Hey, what's up, super nerds? Today I'm going to show you how to use WAV files in Reason 5. Um, we're going to use the NN19 digital sampler to make a beat. And we're going to make a whole beat out of completely NN19 digital samplers and WAV files. So get ready. I'm going to move quick because I don't want you to be bored. All right, so we're in Reason 5. We have a new, uh, brand new project file. I'm going to click on my mixer. I'm going to go to Create. I'm going to go here and click on the NN19 digital sampler. Now, here's how you load a WAV file into an NN19 digital sampler. See this little blue button with the white file folder on it? You're going to click on that, browse sample. Uh, now you have a directory, you're going to go to wherever your WAV file is. I know the WAV file I'm going to use is in this folder. We're going to use the Extremely Sad Symphonic Strings Intro Loop, uh, which is a WAV file that I ripped off of a vinyl record. I ripped all these WAV files off of vinyl records. So, this is what we're going to use. I have it selected, I just go down here and click OK, boom, now it's loaded in my NN19 digital sampler, but you still can't use it yet. You see how it says extremely sad, blah blah blah, whatever down here that shows you that it's loaded into there, but we can't use it until we click this one button right here. You're not, uh, you just click solo sample, boom, see how that's highlighted? You need to always make sure solo sample is highlighted when you're using a WAV file with the NN19 digital sampler. Otherwise, you're not going to be able to hear your WAV file. So we've enabled solo sample. Um, now we can go over here and play with our sample. But it's really low, so we're going to go back to the uh, to the rack window and uh, just turn the volume up on this amp amplifier right here. Just turn the volume up in the amp envelope. The volume's up. I'm going to drop the filter frequency a little bit because it is a vinyl sample. There should be some high-end crackles in it. If I drop the filter frequency just a little bit, this should counteract that. So now that I've turned the volume up right here on the amp, amp slider, I'm going to go back over here. It should be louder. Yeah, it sounds better. It sounds a lot better. And you can just mess with it. But I already know what I want to do because I already thought about this tutorial before I made it. So I'm going to drag it out here. All right, this is what this is what it's going to sound like essentially when I loop it. You see, you catch my drift, so I'm going to... Copy it. Control-C, Control-V. Um, our loop is turned on. Loop's turned on. Um, and I'm just going to drop it down to 97 beats per minute because I know that this loop goes perfectly at 97 beats per minute. So, And now this is what it sounds like. Alright, for the next part of the tutorial, I'm going to show you what you already know. But I'm going to show you how to, pretty much we're just going to continue making this beat with another NN19 digital sampler. You already know how to do it, so, you know, follow along. We're going to create, <coughs> excuse me, another NN19 digital sampler. We're going to load another sample into it this time, except this time we're going to find a drum loop in one of my drum folders. Yes, this is the one we're using. So, now you know. Click solo sample before you try and do anything. We loaded our we loaded the STD break into here. Click solo sample. Uh, turn your volume up right here. Turn your level up. I'm going to drop the filter frequency a little bit, but you don't have to do anything with it. You don't have to do that. All right, so now we got solo sample enabled, volume turned up. We're going to go over here, and we're going to mess with this break beat.
So look at that. We just made a beat using only the NN19 digital sampler. Uh, we loaded a string, a string sample into the into one, and um, we loaded a break beat into another NN19 digital sampler, and we got a beat made. You know what I'm saying? That's really dope. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope you learned something. Give me some feedback. Tell me what you think about it. Uh, tell me if it was helpful. I had fun making this beat. I think I'm actually just gonna keep recording while I fuck with this beat for a minute and make a dope beat. So I hope you enjoy it. You, you're welcome to stay if you want. If you don't, just fucking subscribe. Please subscribe and uh, check out my other tutorials. I'm here to teach you. Uh, if you want my samples, I got a ton of samples. I got thousands and thousands of samples. If you want them, uh, talk to me. Send me a message. And I want money, and I'll give you all my samples. All right? Like via Dropbox or something. Or I could even send you a disc in the mail if you wanted. All right? Peace, motherfuckers. stop right here i just farted really got loud guys and i realized the mic was still on uh there's a little more i don't know if you guys heard that or not it was funny i'm only addressing it because you might have heard it i don't know if you guys heard it so if you heard it i did it if you didn't hear it good for you Suddenly Excuse me.